time for the ultimate cricket quiz. Come on, you phoenix! Good evening and welcome to the ultimate cricket quiz. It's round three and we're looking to see who's going to be crowned Professor Phoenix 2023. Let's look where we are on the leaderboard after round two. We have Sagar on 29. We have Rohan at 28. Isaac, last year's champion, on 27. Jamie on 24. DHG on 21. And Jim on 18. Ben's also on 18 with a great effort. Henry and Neil both on 17. Baz is on 15 and Carl on eight. So before we start round three, <laughs> let's see what the guys have got to do. <laughs> round three is the same as normal. We ask our players 10 cricket trivia questions. Every correct answer is worth two points. Each player gets to choose a question where they can play their joker, and that correct answer is worth double points. But they have to play their joker at the time of the question, as there's no going back when we passed it. The original cricket wickets used only two stumps. Is that true or false? True. Um, I think false. I think it means you only used one. False. Uh, that is true. False. <laughs> <laughs> true. Well, Chertsey claimed to have introduced the third stump, so um, uh, unless it's one, I will say true. False. I think that's true. True. False. True. Nelson is a term used to refer what score? Two, 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 one, one, one. Uh, all three numbers same. 111. One, one, one. Quarter of a century, 25? 150. Okay. Joker, 111. One, one. I think, is it 111? One, one, one. Joker. Uh, 111, and I'll use my Joker. 111, uh, one, one. <laughs> one and I'm playing my Joker. Okay. 111, because it looks like the wickets without the bales on. Among Australian players, what score is considered to be unlucky? Or Who? maybe, maybe let me say 13, not 13. 23. Is it 99? I don't, honestly don't know this one, but so the guess is 13, but that's too obvious. 13? Uh, 333. Three, three. Oh, which one is it? I think I'll say 77. Yeah, it's 13 away from 100, so 87. 87. No, don't know. 69, probably down in them Aussies. 87. 13 short of 100. <laughs> Who is the only Indian cricketer to play for England and India? Um, don't know. Basil Dolavera, make it up. Pass. Pass. <clears throat> Sing. No, pass. Um, I'll say Ranjit Singhi. Um, Farooq Engineer. Simon Masala. <laughs> pass. No, I can't. That's so annoying. It is the father of Mansour Ali Khan Patordi. Um, because it was, uh, it's, it's the grandfather of my mate, Saif Ali Khan. But Iftika, if, I think it's if, Iftika Ali Khan Patordi. Iftika Ali Khan Patordi. Who has played the most test matches for the West Indies? Uh, Shiv Chandapal. Uh, Joker, Shiver and Chandapal. Viv Richards. Gordon Greenwich, Desmond, Desmond Haynes, Shivnarine Chandapal. 
I would say Courtney Walsh. Uh, Brian Charles Lara. Um, Chanda Paul. Brian Lara. Sir Garfield Sobers. Brian Lara. I'll play my Joker as well. Siverine Chanda Paul. So with five questions gone, let's have a look at the leaderboard. Well, it's really tight at the top. Sagar is top of the leaderboard with 33. Rohan, close behind at 32. Jamie also on 32. Isaac is on 29. DHG on 27. And Hennes has moved up to 25. So Barry's also on 25. Neil is 23. Jim on 22. Ben on 18. And Carl still on 8 presently. Who is the cricket coach of Sri Lanka? Chris Silverwood. I'll play my joke on that. No, I can't think. Can't think off the top of my head. I'll know it exactly when I. Dear Watmore. Justin Langer. Uh, Chris Silverwood. Jonathan Trott. Uh, Chris Silverwood. Um, Joker. Pass. Bus. Pass. Chris Silverwood. Chris Silverwood. Who was England's first non-English cricket coach? Alan Flower. Fletcher, Duncan Fletcher. I'm not sure, I couldn't tell you. Duncan Fletcher. Fletcher, we'll go with Duncan Fletcher. Uh, Trevor Bayliss. Uh, Duncan Fletcher. Duncan Fletcher. Duncan Fletcher. Gone. Go on. Go on. Oh, sorry. Huh? Uh, Duncan Fletcher. Uh, uh, Joker. Duncan Fletcher. Jamal Brooks plays for which West Indian island? Trinidad and Tobago. <laughs> Trinidad and Tobago. That sounds like uh, Trinidad and Tobago, so I'll do that. Oh, I'll get a guess. I don't know. Now then, Jamal Brooks. Of course, yes. Well, he would be playing for Trinidad and Tobago. Hmm? Leeward Islands. Barbados. Why have you said Antigua? Jamaica. Huh? Barbados. And uh, we'll guess Jamaica. Guyana. Barbados. What two countries played the longest game of cricket ever? In 1939, you get a point for each. So I'm suspecting it might be Australia then. Um, Australia and South Africa. England, Australia. Uh, Australia, I'm oh, sorry, yeah, Australia and England. I think it's Ashes. I can't remember. I'll say New Zealand, England. <laughs> Australia and England. England and Australia. England and Australia. Um, England and Australia. England and Australia. Australia, New Zealand. Yeah, I've got a funny feeling this is England, South Africa, and we had to go um, because we were going to miss the boat. So that's why we stopped. Otherwise, we'd have had the biggest ever run chase. England and South Africa. What was significant about Shahid Afridi's bat when he scored the fastest ODI century? It was aluminium, I think, something like aluminium, metal, some sort of metal aluminium. Maybe he was using one that wasn't made out of uh, willow, I don't know. <laughs> he played with a heavy bat and a double grip. Um, was it a mongoose? It was an illegal size. The size. Okay. 
Is it broken? <laughs> uh, yeah, bro yeah, broken bat. It was the mongoose. Oh, oh, yeah, yeah. Maybe mm -hmm. bend, I'm going with the width of the bat. Is it overweight? Too thick? That it was provided by Sachin Tendulkar. He was using Sachin Tendulkar's bat. So that's the end of round three. Let's see how they stand. Sagar maintains his lead on 40 points. Four points clear of Isaac, who's on 36. Jamie, after a poor first round, has moved up to 35, third place. Rohan on 33. Henna's moving up. He's on 33. DHG on 30. So Barry's up to 29. Jim, 27. Neil on 24. Ben on 23. And Carl's moved up to nine. Well done, Carl. So that's how they stand after round three. And a big week next week as it's the final. Is Sagar going to hold on to his lead or are we in for a tie break? Come on, you Phoenix. Come on, you Phoenix. Come on, you Phoenix.